Okay, you guys, it's Angie. So I am back with another video for you guys. I'm sorry that it's been so long since the last video, but in what is becoming, oops, hang on, it's raining. Like in my car, and it's um, uh, it's actually like really hot. It's almost 60 degrees, and it's so humid, and my hair is like a mess. So just kind of ignore that if you can. But um. I got sick again this past week. This time around it was something with my stomach and um, I'm finally starting to feel better. I don't know if it was like a virus or if it's something that has to do with like my new diet. I'm not really sure what's going on with that yet but um, <clears throat> I started feeling better yesterday and I'm so glad. So um, this week's weigh-in is, well it's a little overdue first of all, but this is the first weigh-in where I haven't lost any weight. Um, this week's weigh-in, I weighed in at 249, and, and last week's was 246, so I was pretty bummed out about that because, uh, you know, I've been really on point with my eating, I'm, I mean, like, I've been killing it, like, I've been eating extremely well, and, uh, I've been drinking tons of water, and the only thing that I can think of is that maybe it's, like, water retention or something, I can't figure out why I would have gained weight this week because, like, that, like it's scientifically I feel like impossible because I haven't been eating enough food to you know gain weight you have like a like a base metabolic rate or whatever where like you burn so many calories a day to maintain the weight that you have and I've been eating less than that so it's pretty much impossible that I have gained weight so that just makes me think that it's something to do with water I'm trying like I know I'm doing weekly weigh-ins but honestly like I'm trying not to focus so much on the scale and maybe just focus more on like how I'm feeling and I'm feeling I'm not my stomach problems are like kind of subsided I'm feeling better and um I'm feeling like my clothes are fitting better so I'm feeling happier there. When I saw that my weigh in was not going to be good I honestly felt like I didn't even want to upload but um, yeah that's not why I'm here. I'm here to track everything and this is just like part of it I guess. Um, and like I said I was pretty frustrated and I even felt a little bit discouraged but I'm not going to let this like slow me down if anything it's just kind of made me a little angry and I'm just kind of using that um I'm going Monday I have to wait I had to wait until my boyfriend was off work so we could go to the gym together and we're going to check on our membership and make sure everything is good with it it's like we have a membership but we just haven't used it in a really long time and we need to make sure everything's all good there so if everything is good with our gym membership I will be starting working out Monday I feel like that's something that's like really missing from uh really missing from my routine right now that I need to be doing so I'm planning on starting working out probably Monday and from then on I'll be working out I'm starting probably two to three days a week I don't want to go like too crazy and uh, kind of like burn myself out I've done that in the past and I'm just trying not to make the same mistakes that I've made in the past that always cause me to end up failing so that is this week's kind of like weight update stuff um, I also wanted to add that as part of my channel, I want this to be kind of like, I want to track my weight loss journey. Like I know the subscribers that I have are here for that reason. Uh, I want to be able to track my weight loss journey, but I also want to be able to like incorporate other types of videos into my channel. Uh, like, cause this channel is just kind of like my life and, um, you know, while it is largely real, you know, related to my weight loss journey I want to also be able to post about other topics that I find interesting and um, things like that so I mean I hope that's okay with you guys I, f I I don't I wouldn't post anything that I don't think you know people would find interesting um, so yeah I'm just really excited about uh, like doing some different kinds of videos I don't know if you can uh, tell but my hair color is like super faded and I just got out of Sally Beauty Supply and um, I picked up some stuff I picked up um, well, I just got one I got a bleach packet and I got a packet of hair color remover I've never used this stuff before so I'm hoping that it's uh, good I got a new bowl and like I got two new brushes I got some 20 and 30 volume develop 20 and 30 volume developer 
and I got some red hair dye. So, if you can't tell, I'm going to be busy trying to strip this green color out of my hair and I'm going to go back to my original red. I get kind of bored with my hair color every so many months and I want to change. I've had this color since I looked it up and it was like since mid-September. So about four months I've had this and I'm ready for a change. Prior to this color it was actually like purple and blonde and I had that color for about five months. So every three, four, five months or so I like to change my hair color and uh, this time around I'm going with like probably it depends on how this color comes out. If it comes out and um, what I really want is like red and blonde mixed. Like I want some like red with blonde through it or blonde with red through it however you want to do it um i just kind of wing it but it just depends on how this color comes out with what i'm able to do i may have to just dye the whole thing like dark red i'm hoping that's not the case because i'd really like to have some blonde in my hair but um we'll see how it goes it was really easy last time i removed the purple i had no problems at all it came right out so i'm hoping this time around is going to be good actually going to go to the thrift store but i kind of changed my mind um it's just really rainy and it's like I just, I don't know, I don't feel like, I actually need to go to the grocery store as well. I have been, um, really loving Halo Top this past week. Um, I want to really try the peanut butter one. So far, my favorite are vanilla bean. And, um, what's the other one? What's the other one that I really liked? Uh, the vanilla bean and the mint, uh, mint chip. I think is what it's called is my favorite those two are my favorites I love them so much so uh, I really want to try the peanut butter one so I might pick that up tonight I have to go to the grocery store and um, pick up some water and some chicken and things like that and I would like to update you guys that I have not drank a single soda in I think what like three weeks now so that's totally awesome and I'm totally happy with that so yeah um, I guess that's going to conclude this video. I just wanted to check in with you guys really quick and let you know like what was going on. Um, I'm hoping that next week's weigh-in will be positive. I really don't know why my weight would have increased uh, with me eating the way that I've been eating. Like I said, I'm going to incorporate some exercise and see if that helps. And um, I'm just really excited for the next week. I'm Instead of being discouraged, I'm like encouraged and I'm really ready to drop some serious weight. So... I hope that all your guys I hope that all you guys are doing awesome on your journeys and I hope that you're meeting your goals and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.